We're also following some breaking news in Queens where police say three people were rushed to the hospital after getting shot at a busy intersection in Jamaica. CBS 2's Lisa Rosner is live at the scene with more on what happened there. Lisa? Well, Jessica, this all happened just before 2 p.m. here on Sutphin Boulevard, and the crime scene appeared to span at least an entire block. The crime scene yeah, unit just yeah, left. Bob. However, you can see over here uh, there was in front of the fish market clothing that was all over the sidewalk. Then if you pan further down the block, there were items from a deli that were outside. That is right near Archer Avenue. We are told all three victims are expected to survive. Police tell us they are a 24-year-old man, a 29 Nine year old man and a 21 year old woman all shot at least once. What we know from police is that there was a verbal dispute before shots were fired, but it's unclear who was targeted and whether any of the victims are innocent bystanders. Police say the suspect was wearing a blue bubble jacket, blue Adidas pants, and a mask. Citizen App is reporting that the suspect ran toward Jamaica Avenue and 144th Place. We spoke with witnesses. I was arriving, you know, from early voting. You know, I went to early voting, and I, it was it was a chaotic scene. It was just chaotic. They were put into the stretcher and into the into the ambulance as as quickly as possible to send them to the hospital. They tell me like somebody got shot outside, and they go to the store. There was a shooting here not too long ago, probably a couple of months in the summertime. So unfortunately, somebody got injured, which doesn't happen again. Witnesses did see a police helicopter and canine units on scene in the search for the suspect. Again, all three victims were taken to Jamaica Hospital and are expected to survive. There are no arrests at this time, and the investigation is ongoing. We're live in Jamaica, Queens. Lisa Rosner, CBS 2 News. All right, Lisa, thank you.